What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. My name is Chris. That's Mike. Yes, sir. What is up, Chris? The terror infamy is up, Mike. That is what's going on. Uh, episode it's not four. The, it's not terror the infamy. No. Oh. You wish it was. Uh, <laughs> the infamy. infamy uh, episode infamy. four. The weak are meat. So. Um, we start out, Chester's in Guadalcanal. He's been, yeah. he's working with another Japanese American and, you know, they're translating, translating. He doesn't, he's not been sleeping. He's been chasing the Uri. He mm -hmm. asks his buddy what I got out. So what I like about that whole, you know, beginning type of thing is he's, he's asking his buddy, Hey, you ever hear this thing? He's like, yeah, you know, they're fake though. Don't worry about it. Well, why are they doing it? And he says, Oh, you know, they, the Uri, they want something and they're going to spend the eternity trying to get it. And he's like, well, shit, you know? Yeah. Um, I thought that was interesting. You know, we, we're, we're learning a little bit, a little more of, of what this thing is. And dude, a lot of stuff happened. Kind this of. Episode. <laughs> well, kind of right. Well, yeah, it was, I mean, it, there's still so many questions. I mean, we'll so get into let, it. Let's obviously. get into it. So Luz spending time, trying to spend time with the family. Henry's still yeah. being a jerk about it, but yeah. you know, everyone else is okay. She's still seeing Yuko. Mm -hmm. um with the baby and you know which is so there's question one what what's up with that what's up with yeah. that what's up with that <laughs> she gives um she gives her the karate kid two drum mm -hmm. for the baby she does. so like she's protecting she these babies she wants these oh she wants these babies maybe she wanted that's what it is like what's her agenda you so know like I, what's her i here's the thing i was like motives. so we know that yoshida and and faruya faruya they and whoever else did something to somebody, right? Yeah. Particularly Yuko. And maybe she was pregnant and they killed her and lost a baby. Some, something yeah. happened that yeah. she's now connected to to these to Chester for some reason and the baby. I, I don't understand it yet. Well, that could be a reason why she may be protecting them is because of the babies themselves. Maybe she feels like she would take them away or something like that and um yeah i don't know i mean we talked about this in the last episode why why would remember uh lose fell and and we they, it was about this 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 gust of wind no but came. you so, so, so tell me that so so there so there's a theory right what's the theory is that and in this episode they said oh no they you know the the the, the, the women were talking and he's and they're all like oh chester okay so she's gonna have twins and they say twins are bad luck and the one woman says to chester's mom you know, yeah, you know, you you know, your son was surrounded by misfortune. He's she's like, oh well, and they're like, they he took that with him when he left, and that's what he's been chasing out in the, the jungle. Yeah, something we don't know something exactly cut what the, something that is. shredded the the yeah. the wall. Like so, so there is something. There is something. Well, we don't know what it. I so mean, is it good? I mean, <laughs> are they good and bad? Yeah, is there a good yeah. and bad uh, now? Uh, right. That's it. That's it. Is it, um, is, is, I mean, could you call, uh, Yuko good? I mean, we don't, uh, she's it, killing it's, people. She killed the soldier. So here's yeah. the other problem we have. Here's the other problem we have. <laughs> yeah. The soldier found her mm -hmm. and, and made him kill herself. And Yuko made him kill himself, but he had that bottle of sake, which led to the ransacking of the, of the, of the whole yeah, thing. Yeah. I, I mean, they're ransacking the barracks. So it's, does uh by protecting chester and his family i mean that's not that wouldn't look like that's what her intention was by 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 taking the bottle um and leaping off is going to infuriate i guess the sergeant right it left did. right it left so it left so did but she what was know the... that chester's family had the bottle i mean i don't necessarily think she knew that they had a stash it just turned out to be that way maybe I'm because guessing. then walt 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 yeah, says I make it. I just give it to. He just drinks it or something. He was, and this guy's ready to blame. You know, uh, uh, Henry. Uh, well, well, Henry first, and then, and then Yoshida's like, no, you know, like because yeah. it, it, it's Walt Yoshida who says that he was blaming the the daughter. I forget her, Je Jenny, Amy, Amy, Jenny, Amy. Um, yeah. So I. <sighs> Again, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, there's I don't so have many, any theories on that, man. I don't really have any theories either. Um, I mean, the, the big, the big, uh, the big theory, or not even the big theory, the big motive for Yuko, we thought were just about the babies. So what, you know, 
uh, dude, it's tough because we've been asking these questions, the same questions every friggin' episode so far. Now, this is the fourth episode. We still don't know about Yuko. We still don't know if she's good. We don't know if there's two parts of this. We don't know if the evil part is after Chester there. And, I mean, we see the slashes in the tent. We don't know if the good part is Yuko because even though it seems like she cares about the babies that Luz is potentially going to have, look what she – I mean, she, she's a fucking – Gross, disgusting. So, so while we're here, let's stay here and, and let's talk about it. She gives birth, Ugh, and rough. they're both and they're both stillborn. Rough, dude. They're both. Yeah, I was so upset. And dude. she's in. Remember, she's in the nurse's body. So now, so right, so Yuko shows up yeah. into the nurse's body to be there yeah. for the birth. They're they they're they're, they're dead. She yeah. obviously blames the doctor. Goes mm-hmm. back and kills the doctor. Yeah, Here's she's like, the thing. Do something. Do something. Do What's something. Up? Yeah. I I I'm so confused by this character. Mm. The, the the soldier finds her sewing up her face again. Then she doesn't have. Then she's fine when she takes over the nurse. Then she goes to kill a doctor, and she's all. And we see her true form, which is nasty yeah. and awesome. I don't know. I don't know. It was like fucking worse. The the ma- underneath the mask, her real face, or the, or the, or the mask, mask itself, right? Dude. So it's like, like when she what was walking through like the what, fucking the, I'm like the, holy the festival shit. whatever. So like what? So like what? So what? It what is what is going on? I don't know what is happening with this character. And also, know. why would why were those they, babies were kicking? They were fine, remember? And then yeah. she was outside, and then and 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 she got the picture, and she showed the dad, and then the dad mm-hmm. was like, oh, kind of warming up to her. She let she let her mom. Well, that was her a mother in law basically. I mean, yeah, touched the baby, felt the kicking, like they were kicking. What happened? Yeah. Yeah. Was, I don't know. I mean, I don't necessarily I know. think it was something mystical or, you know, a uh, curse kind of a thing, even but though what, they spoke about the, the curse fuck, of twins. Dude, you know? um, yeah, I, I think that was just naturally. Unfortunately, that was just the situation. Sucks, um, it's it's the 40s. I mean, they're, they're not having sonograms. They're in in these barracks in this military control. You got a ghost camp. midwife listening, going. Good, yeah, good. So I just think that good. unfortunately, I don't know, man. Goes, and what sucks um, is, you know, she did a re- that was a really a really. You know, heartwarming little speech she did to Henry. Oh, to Henry, I know that and, was great, and that was like all respect. Yeah, that was, I, I, that was just straight respect. It back. was, it was just really good. It was just really mm-hmm. good. So, yeah. So I don't was... know. So I don't know what's going on there, but you know, I don't know. I don't well, know. Well, this but... is this is my well. First of all, um, after I mean, obviously the actor that that plays Luz was fantastic. I mean, I felt so bad for her when she was on the table and she's, what happened to my babies? How come my babies aren't crying? Like, I was like, holy shit, like, this is fucked up. Um, so she did a fantastic job. Uh, you know, it's, it's, um, before we, before we, I mean, obviously talk about, um, the end again, um, maybe I don't want to forget about Chester and after helping find this sergeant, that he had the, you know, uh, he tells them uh, the giant door. He's doing all these, these translations, and and they find this, this sergeant. What do you think about that? That whole scene is, uh, you know, when they first found him, and he's talking all this stuff, and and he's going at Chester, and, uh, and Chester's screaming, "You're already, you're the, you're, you know." It, well, it, that's it, the thing. Chester's bad, Chester's bad Chester's ass. fucked up because yeah. he hasn't slept. He's having waking dreams yeah. of being killed by the URA. Mm-hmm. He's and, seen her, yeah. And he's talking, and well, no, he didn't see her there. He saw her as the friend. What was the buddy's name? The other translator. He oh, sees he saw Yuko. Him. Yeah, yeah, but he why? saw Yuko there too. Or is know. that just him? No, but see, is that just him because he thinks Yuko's a Yure, but Yuko's back in the states doing that, and yeah. this could be a, yeah, a malevolent I mean, spirit. She I don't. Can, she, she can go into different bodies and stuff. Who's I don't. To say what I don't the know. I don't know. Through? I don't. I think he was just his. I think that was just his hallucination. It could. It could. It could have been like a but hallucination. But here's the thing. This guy, this sergeant or whatever, right? Yeah. He seems like he's possessed. He seems like he's possessed. And later in the episode, when, of course, there's always got to be a freaking douchebag that's got a mess, yeah. right? He gets roasted by this yeah. sergeant. Him and the, him and his lackeys trying to beat up on you know Chester. On Chester yeah. Gets roasted. Now Chester survives without a scratch, basically. It could be supernatural, or it just could be the fact that the body was on top of him and he didn't get burned. Yeah, because they I make think, it think, seem yeah like that. But then the guy, he's like, "Oh, he's still going, he's still going," and he's like, "Oh, you're you're right, you're you're right," and he's like, "I know, I just said that in two different ways." But, um, and then no, he says, "Oh no, I'm you know I'm I'm I, I'm serving uh, Takahashi," 
Yeah, he keeps saying, kill the white devil, kill, kill the, the white, white devil. devil. So, so, then, so now, practically, it could yeah. just be a Stockholm Syndrome, Syndrome situation yeah. where he was being held prisoner by Takahashi's people, and they brainwashed him yeah. to say these things. Because he was saying the same things over and over. It's not like he kept saying yeah. new things. He was saying the same things over and, and over. And, and I think the other translator said it too in their intent. He was just brainwashed, you know, whatever. I think he even says that. Maybe, yeah. So, um, so I don't yeah, think this. I don't think he's being. I don't. I think that's a thing. It's a. It's a practical thing. Where I think was, I'm with you too. I think I'm yeah. with you too. Because at first I'm like, is something in him? Because he seemed to be speaking. I mean, he's saying the same phrases over and over. But he, right, yeah. it, there were some times where it seemed like he was maybe saying other stuff. Uh, and I was kind of like, hmm, does this guy all of a sudden know Japanese or or not? But yeah, um, uh, fucking crazy. Uh, uh, with you, I mean, with the blowtorch thing, I kind of think the same with you. I'm thinking yeah. that it's just because yeah. the positioning of the body on top of him, he kind of got spared. Um, last thing for me, mm-hmm. yeah, one of the one of the most heartbreaking scenes of of the episode was the fact that. You know, obviously the whole episode they're writing back and forth, losing Chester. Mm-hmm. The, that that final letter is about how excited she is for Chester's return, and she announces that they're gonna have twins. And uh, I so believe her she and the even, dad are getting old. Yeah, the yeah, dad likes the said, name, and yeah, exactly. And and the look of of um, joy and happiness, joy on face, exactly yeah. on Chester's face. And then meanwhile, we already knew what happened with right, yeah. Lou's already. Um, I thought that was like, I mean, that was that was heartbreaking, but um, definitely, definitely tough to watch because I feel for Chester. I wonder how he's going to react once he finds out the news. Um, you know, and and let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. That final scene with the doctor and he's cleaning up, and and Yuko is wearing the mask and all this kind of stuff. Now remember, um, Luz is in that same in the other room mm-hmm. uh, recovering. Do you think they're going to blame? lose for cutting killing the doctor and cutting open his stomach i mean we didn't see that because um, Luz is sleeping He's i don't gonna wake up and i honestly i don't and i don't think so doctor. because the coming attraction for the next episode show that now they're like making them like register their um history their like f- family history or something and or their citizenship or whatever i don't think we saw lose though in it did we no so that's what I'm saying. I feel like this is like the next step. Like they're like, okay, now you have to prove. I don't know. I think they're they're doing some shit like that. I don't think they're gonna. I don't think they're gonna. Yeah, um, I don't know. I just saw. I'm like, shit. I hope she doesn't get blamed for. Yeah, I thought about. I mean, that listen. Too. Two babies. The guy delivers two. Um, two babies that are, that are that are dead. Right. Uh, you know, she would go crazy. I don't and, know, man. And I don't know. I, I I hope not. But look, either way. Uh, I'm really enjoying the show. It's uh, yeah. it's getting more creepy, which is really cool. Well, still a lot of a lot of questions. Still a lot oh, of man. Questions. It's it's yeah. It's it's but you know. But I like it though. I like it. No, I like I coming up it. with Dude, little I theories and I like watching what's going down close. and yeah. seeing where it goes. It's 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 look. It's another good show. And and you know, I'm glad, and the I'm actors glad we're talking are great. About. Oh, they're fantastic. The actors yeah. do a great job. The yeah. actors do a great job. Yeah, it's an it's um it's if show. that if that Yuko mask isn't like one of the top selling Halloween masks, I, <laughs> this this uh, season I might, have to, go, I I might have to go go like that for Comic Con, right, dude? That fucking that was creepy, man. So creepy. That, that was creepy was when creepy. we saw that in the coming attractions. And yeah, the, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. So um, yeah. I, I mean, I guess that's it, right? That'll uh, do it. That'll do yeah. it. That's it. Uh, you guys, let us know what you're thinking uh, about this AMC series, uh, Infamy. Uh, the Infamy, the the Terror series, um, very cool stuff. Right in the comment section below, we love hearing from you guys. Uh, I did it again, right? Yep. You said <laughs> the Infamy. You actually went out of your way to say the Infamy. The Infamy, the Terror. Screw it. You're the getting show. that. I don't you know care. It it's great. Thirdpersonpod.com. Uh, check us out there in the Google search, and it brings you right to our our channel. We have a whole bunch of stuff there. Other shows that we're that we're covering right now, the Wu Assassins. So if you're not watching Wu Assassins, it's a fantastic series on Netflix. Check yep. that out. Yep. Uh, we got some awesome interviews uh, on the channel as well. If you're Badlands fans, we got a bunch of the Badland cast on there. We did an awesome interview with uh, special effects legend John Bruno, who did uh, The Abyss, Gremlins, Titanic, uh, of course Nosferatu. Uh, we did the Nosferatu reviews, another AMC series. We got a lot of stuff on there, a lot of um, uh, ex- 
awesome, awesome content. Stuff that you can just sit there and watch and just listen. And uh, me and Chris really don't have to say anything because the stuff. interviewees that we have, yep. they just say some cool stuff, uh, interesting stuff. So, again, thanks for supporting the channel. Check out uh, Infamy. Uh, the Terror, the terror Infamy. Infamy. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys are enjoying it. Yep, same here. All right, thanks, everyone. We'll see you next episode for the Terror Infamy. Peace.